Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this session, we will see SAP ML Physical Inventory. So, the agenda of the session is Overview of Physical Inventory, How to Create Physical Inventory Document, Followed by Entering Count Result and Posting the Differences. So, let's start with Overview of Physical Inventory process. Once a material is procured from the vendor, it will be stored in our organization at a storage place that we call as Inventory. An account will be posted against received quantity in the system. That count may differ because of the reasons like damaged or destroyed material. So, organizations prefer to execute physical inventory process at end of every month. So, physical inventory is a process of determining that inventory quantities are exact or if there are differences in quantity that is physically present and that mentioned in the SAP system. So, to execute physical inventory process, it is a three-step process. First is we will be creating a physical inventory document by going to transaction code MI01. Next step is entering the count result. So, we will be entering exact amount of stock that is physically present by going to transaction code MI04. Now, third and final step is posting the differences. To post the differences between the stock that is physically present and the stock that is present in system, we will be going to transaction code MI07. So, let's do all these functions practically. First step that comes under managing physical inventory is creating a physical inventory document for the material for which you are counting at the end of fiscal year. So, to create physical inventory document, enter transaction code. MI01 in command field. This will navigate you to create physical inventory document page. Here you need to enter your document date. You need to enter your pl plant count date. You need to enter your plant and storage location for which you are performing physical count. In other information tab you have two important fields that is posting block and freeze book inventory. Posting block means once your physical inventory document is created, you cannot receive or issue goods for that particular material. Second checkbox is freeze book inventory. If this is checked, even if your physical inventory document is created, you can receive or issue goods, but the stock will be freezed for that physical inventory. That means if extra stock is received after the document date, it will not be included in physical inventory count. So, I am entering test data here. I am making as posting block check. Now press enter. This will navigate you to the second page. Here you need to enter your material for which you are creating a physical inventory document. So I am entering test data here. So your material is added here. Once your physical inventory document is complete, click on save. Your physical inventory document is created generating a message. Now second step is entering count for your material that is physically present. But before we do that we will check stock of material. To check stock of material go to transaction code slash and MMBE. Here you need to enter your material, plant and storage location. Then click on execute. So total stock that is present in system is 855. Now we will enter amount of material that is physically present. So we will go to transaction code MI04 that is slash n m i 4 this will navigate you to enter inventory count screen here you need to enter your physical document number fiscal year and count date so i have entered my physical document my fiscal year and count date now press enter 
here you need to enter the quantity that is physically present so suppose I am taking actual count that is physically present as 853 so I will enter 853 over here now click on save after entering the count your physical count is now entered generating a physical inventory document number as same as we posted in MI01 now third step is to post inventory difference that is the stock that is physically present and the stock that is present in system so go to transaction code slash and MI07 this will navigate you to post inventory difference screen here you need to enter your physical inventory document number fiscal year and posting date once you enter all these details press enter here you can see there is as difference quantity of 2 as actual stock that is present in system is 855 and that is physically present is 853 so difference quantity remains as 2 now click on save to post inventory difference once your inventory difference is posted we will again check the stock in transaction code MMBE so your post inventory difference is posted now now we will again check stock in transaction code slash and MMBE enter your material plant and storage location now click on execute now in system as well stock is changed to 853 that is physically present so the difference of 2 is cleared in system by posting the difference in transaction code MI07 so in previous sessions we have learned basics of materials management configurations in materials management and end-to-end -end flow of procurement cycle so in this session we learned how to manage physical inventory and in all previous sessions we learned the basics of SAP materials management so keep practicing good luck